Okay, so Dad sent this box from Afghanistan for Christmas for Kirsten and Kiernan. Now they get to open it. Kiernan, what do you think's in it? A robot and a unicorn. Kirsten, what do you think's in it? A robot unicorn! Okay, open it up. Go over there real slow. Wait for Kirsten. Open the door. Open the door. Ah, wait, I found how to open it. Pull it, Kirsten, pull it. Among today's holiday travelers, a local soldier who just returned home from Afghanistan. News 5's Brian Hamrick is live at CVG with what was really a happy homecoming, Brian. Yeah, Cheryl, you know, the day before Thanksgiving, the airport is the last place many people want to be. But for one family, this airport was the greatest place on earth. Before what you're seeing really makes sense. <laughs> This is mom. No. This is son. Oh, yeah, there's something else. I'm um, coming in from Afghanistan on a 12 month deployment. That's about it. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just so glad he's safe and he's home. Staff Sergeant James Montgomery is reuniting with his family, giving Thanksgiving more thanks than ever this year for his wife. Honey! So much. It makes you appreciate what you have. This is the best Thanksgiving ever. This is the best Thanksgiving ever. He's home, he's safe, and he's with his family. What Sergeant Montgomery savors now is far from food. You know, just glad to be alive. One family will wrap their arms around Thanksgiving like never before. <laughs> the love of me. <laughs> oh. Oh. Now Staff Sergeant Montgomery is here. He'll be here for 15 years days but he goes back to Afghanistan but he's only there for 60 60 more days and he comes home again for good that'll be a real homecoming reporting live Brian Hamrick news mein Vater ne warte du kaufst ne ich sag's erst und dann fangt ihr an ne weil ähm erst sag ich den Chair und den hier dann 
Ne, lass, oh, nee, 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 lass dann jetzt erstmal den Cheers sagen. Okay. Okay? Okay, hold on. Alright. Who rocks the house? Who rocks the house? Not you! I'm here. I'm back to see my family, my mom, my dad, and the little ones that are at school. I came to surprise them. <laughs> I'm definitely glad to be able to see them again. It's been about two and a half years since I've been able to see them, so I can't wait to see them. Tell me, what would you like for Christmas? What's your, what's your biggest wish? I'll tell you what, would this work? Come on out. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? Good? Good? I think he's happy. <laughs> Jordan, is that a pretty good present? Would yeah, that, I told you he Christmas? was getting a present today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have him for nine days. We're going to make the most of it. How, how can we say this? Uh, nine days with sun. Ticket from Japan. Son be here with family. Priceless. There's your Christmas present. Go see your brother. Go see your brother. Go see your brother. Go see Colin, I'm coming here to surprise my little sister. I uh, just got back from Afghanistan a few weeks ago and it's my first day on leave, so it should be pretty good. Colin just got home yesterday. He'll be home for about a week. We haven't seen him now since January of last year, and so we've had like one or two video chats, but besides that, now we haven't seen him at all. So, for some reason, we just kind of were more attached than me and my other siblings. I'll give her a nice big hug. I was really surprised. It's to have them surprise me like this. It was really fun. And just to watch Kaylee's. Kaylee's expression is priceless. <laughs> what, what kind of went through your mind? What were you thinking? Like, oh my god, I can't believe this. My brother's home. How 
don't know. Too long, right? Oh, Eight yeah. Yeah. I'm, all my friends are gonna be happy for me. Uh, I was really glad she uh, she was actually surprised that my mom didn't ruin it. But I don't know, it was fun. No, I can't. I was so happy and excited for him to be home. Well, about three weeks ago, oh, three weeks ago, we had a young man who just got here out of the Navy, and we honored him and brought him up, and, and a parent said to me, you know, why don't the parents, anybody ever say something nice about a parent? So please listen up, because you're going to like this. This We got a hold of this mother and father. Someone gave us the name. I don't did not know them. I just met them tonight, and I found out the father had to leave, but this mother... Her son is in the Marines. He's uh, deployed. He's going to be back. And I just found out today he'll be back in about a week. So he's going to be home pretty soon. But I just thought it'd be nice. Donna, Donna Predico, would you come up here? Donna, come up here. This young woman's just a 20 year old son serving his country. They represent Kyle Falls. How about a nice hand for this mother? Say hello. Michael's coming back next week, right? He might be. She thinks he's coming back next week. But I just thought, you know, I, these are the kind of things that uh, can bring tears to your eyes. And I just thought we might have a little surprise, give her a flower, do something for her. But since you're a good mother, and what the hell, you haven't seen your son in a year, and he did, he did not marry a foreign girl. So don't worry about that. But I thought... We might have a little surprise for Donna. Bob, if you will. So you just say hello to the crowd. Wave to everybody. You recognize the song yet? Donna, we got a surprise for you.
Thank <laughs> you.